Hey guys, what is going on? On today's video, we are gonna do another try of the pickled hot dogs, but this one's gonna be a little bit different. Last week, um, I think it's about a week, week and a half ago, I did a video where I made some homemade pickled hot dogs. Uh, I did my own, uh, basically my own brine, mixed all the ingredients up myself, but this week we're gonna do a little bit different. We're gonna actually use pickle juice from pickles, dill pickles. We're just gonna kind of mash this together. It's gonna be a one, two, three type of thing. We're gonna add it all together, come back in about a week and give them a try. So let's go ahead over here to the counter. I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do. We're gonna try these things out. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these hot dogs. We're gonna add, I'm only gonna do four hot dogs. I don't wanna do the whole package. Add it to the jar and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take pickle juice that has already been eaten. There's no more pickles in them. We're just gonna pour it on the top, pack this thing in, seal it, and then let them sit for a week. But I got this really cool thing I wanna show you. This dude right here, this is a meat tenderizer that has these really sharp edges. What I'm gonna do is we're gonna open this up and I'm gonna roll this on all the hot dogs and perforate each one in a really cool manner and see how that works and see if that helps with the juices and the brine getting in these hot dogs. Okay, so I'm gonna open these guys up. All right, we're gonna take four hot dogs out. These are already cooked, pre-cooked, 100% beef franks. We're gonna go ahead and take this dude right here and do this awesome little roll on it. You can see the little holes that it makes in each one. So, All right, so we're done. Let's go ahead and take these guys, drop them in. How you doing? Hi. <laughs> That's it. Let's take the Mount Olive. The cool thing about this is it's already done. I don't have to make the brine. Cold hot dogs, cold jar, cold uh, pickle juice, pure pickle juice. Let's just fill this thing up. We're gonna cover the hot dogs all the way. There they are. I'm just gonna cover this up, get it nice and tight, and there it is. All right, so that was the easiest pickled anything that I've ever done. And uh, yeah, we're gonna come back in a week, which again, is only gonna be in about three seconds. We'll come back, taste these things out, see what they taste like in uh, three, two, one. All right guys, so we are back, and now finally these dudes are done, but I will tell you, at the beginning of the video I said I was gonna do these in about one week, and I had so much going on that these have been in the refrigerator. It's been about two and a half weeks now, maybe three weeks. I think it's about two and a half weeks. So we're gonna go ahead and give these uh, pickled hot dogs a try. You ready to open them up? Yep. Say, mm -hmm. uh, what were you doing? No. Okay. Here, am I in it? The piece of gum stuck on my tooth. So, all right, we're opening them up and they, these smell more like you could smell the dill pickles and the hot dog at the same time. There they are. <laughs> you come over here and try one. Okay. All right. They did turn kind of green, and I don't know. Are they good? I don't know. We're gonna try it. It is bad. Ooh. <laughs> They're not. Let me. T I will tell you. Here, let me show you this. I'm cutting it up, and they're not as like snappy as the other ones. They almost look. Uh, they almost look dry. I don't know. It's really weird. Dry. Mm-hmm. Yeah, these look kind of different. The other ones, when I cut them open, let me let me go show you one of the ones that I made a couple weeks ago and show you the difference. So here they are. These are the ones that I made a couple weeks ago in the jar. And let's go ahead and open this up and show you the difference of, they smell really, I love these. Let's go ahead and cut one of these up. See how that looks different when I cut them open? Those actually have the red and these do not. I don't want to eat one. <laughs> what? You don't want to eat one? Come on, you could try one. They are they are different altogether. These have like a, a nice snap I'm to them. A paper boat in here I don't know. So far. You're making a paper boat. Yeah. Awesome. Without further ado, we're gonna eat it. You ready? But I've gum in mine. Is it good? Mmm. It. You could taste it. It tastes like a dill pickle. Hmm. Take a bite. It tastes like a dill pickle with a hot dog, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. You like it? Mm -hmm. It's okay. Yeah. I mean, they're not terrible. Mm -hmm. You know, 
They actually just taste like a dill, they have that dill pickle flavor and they're a little softer. Okay, you wanna try it? All right, now try this one, Linz. Is it a red one or regular hot? Yeah, it's just a dill, it's another, it's the one I made. So that's the one that I made. So try that one now. Which one do you like better? You like the dill pickle one or do you like the one I made? Can you I, like these better? Can I try the... Here, yeah, you try the dill pickle one. Those are good. Good about it. Is it good? There you go. It's pretty good, honestly. I'll try that one. Yeah, you can try this one. All right, so now there's that one. To see which one's better. No. It's good. <laughs> mm-hmm. No, which one? Good. Oh. You like that one better? All right, so here's the deal. These are pretty good, just going right to okay. right into your pickle juice. But it's these so are a lot better. So. All right, everybody. Well, there's the video. We have a winner out of the dill pickle. Pickled hot dogs and the homemade dill or homemade pickled hot dogs, whatever, with the beet juice and all that good stuff. Check out this video. There's going to be a link in the uh, description. I'll do a card right up here. You can click on that to see how I made these. These are the winner. There's no doubt about it. So, all right, everybody. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Hit that bell button. Get notified of all of our newest videos. And uh, yeah, make sure you do one thing. Stay awesome. All right, everybody. Bye. Bye. See you on the next video. Bye. Bye.